The second P for making friends when you have Asperger's syndrome is plan. It's important to plan. Read any motivational book and you'll see this in there. That's mentioned in Napoleon Hill's classic Think and Grow Rich. You need to plan to get to your goals. Now our goals may be very simple compared to other people's goals. For some people it's a goal to make a million dollars and that's the big point behind Think and Grow Rich. But each of us in life have sometimes goals that are very difficult for us but simple for other people. Now in order to make friends it's important to have a plan. I don't want to leave it to chance. I believe in action and personally I don't believe and I don't feel I deserve something unless I've worked for it. If I get it and I don't work for it, then I feel guilty. I don't know about you, but that's how I feel. So I do have a plan. One of the things I do want to get is a soulmate, and therefore I have a plan to do that. Right now, for example, my plan is to try to visit as many churches, synagogues, temples, and mosques as possible in order to meet my soulmate. Now, this could be a not very good plan, but hey, it's the best thing I can think of at the moment. It's better than going to bars. At least in churches, synagogues, mosques, and temples, you have the hope that people are trying to improve themselves. And improving oneself is a one big characteristic I want in a soulmate. So hey, that's what I'm going with. And I've already tried to visit a lot. And like I mentioned in the previous commentary, perseverance is important. So you have to go through a lot. Jim Rowan calls this a law of averages. So my plan is to meet as many people as I can and hopefully I can come across my soulmate. Now, certainly my plan is not perfect. It couldn't be perfect, but it's a plan. And I encourage you to have a plan as well. And in fact, this is not the only part of meeting a soulmate for me. I have another part of the plan. That's an online thing. I don't want to leave it all to online, but hey, I'm open to that possibility too. So when you're making friends, have a plan. Don't just allow it happen to chance. You can certainly make friends by chance, but take action, take initiative, be proactive, and that's the empowering way.